Hello and welcome to this new lesson. Today, I'll show you the Altium software user interface. So, let's start by going to start menu, then choosing the Altium designer software. As you can see, it's loading. Okay, now this is the user interface. This is Altium Designer 18, but it's very much the same for all versions of the software. Up here, we have a main menu. It's File, View, Project, Windows, and Help. In the right, we have the Libraries and the Documents menu. And here, we have the Projects Explorer. You can go to the Navigator messages and output these are tabs so let's start by creating a new project file new project bcb project as you can see we got a file in the projects explorer window here if we click here in the project itself we can add new to project we can add schematic a bcb or any other file that you want and let's start by adding a schematic file for our component as you can see here we have a different menu because we are in the schematic uh, tab here you can choose to place this menu wherever you want as you can see when you place it here you can simply click it to view and this is our main schematic window. We can click here, add new to project, and then choose BCB. Okay. Now we have a project file that have a schematic, a sheet dot schem doc, which means schematic document, and BCB dot BCB doc which means a BCB document. Now we can save this project in a folder. Let me save everything here. Let's keep it to default name, BCB, okay. And the schematic, okay. This is the project file. So we saved the project and the two, the two files, the schematic and the BCB. Now, as I mentioned earlier, this is the main menu. When you change the uh, file, the menu changed. This is the schematic file and this is the menu. When we add the BCB file, we have a root menu, which is uh, used specifically for the BCB file. And the bottom menu also changed. Here we have multiple colors and we have the navigator as I mentioned earlier. Um, that's it for the user interface. Um, next, we will start building our component symbol. Um, see you next. If you have any question, please ask in the Q&A board.